It's not dry. Until it's ever dry. Until it's ever dry. Well, get a nice picture. Don't drink as much as I used to, which is probably a good thing, but you can always come here and enjoy a few and really enjoy them. This is one of my favorite places to come in Sheboygan. After four decades, a popular bar in Sheboygan is closing its doors. The 80-year-old owner of Emmer's Bar has decided it's time to retire. But his bar has become more than just a place to grab a drink. Our Sheboygan County reporter Mackenzie Hamill talked with the owners Wayne and Tammy Emmer, along with musician Scott News Noiser, who has played at that bar for years. This is Wayne Emmer's spot, and it has been for the last four decades. This is not my bar. This is my family room. You're coming to my family room. But at 80 years old, he's getting ready to give it up to the new owners of his bar, Emmers. It's been a good run. It's been a good run. Emmers has been a Sheboygan staple since 1986. You have to do it yourself. My first three years, never had a day off, really. And that's the way you make it. Wayne started at this location off of 14th in Pennsylvania. He met his wife of 18 years there. I have many customers that came in and they met their spouses here. And some of them we got to meet at their weddings here. They moved to this spot on Maryland and 15th in 1995. It's sad to go, but it's time to go. That's how Scott Noiser feels, too. If anybody deserves, you know, a retirement, it's him. Scott's bands played at the bar for years. I've been controlling the mixer with one hand and playing guitar and singing. He considers Wayne a second dad. I don't drink as much as I used to, which is probably a good thing, but it can always come here and enjoy mm -hmm. a few and really enjoyed them. This is one of my favorite places to come in Sheboygan. I'm just appreciative of the time we got to spend together. If Emmer's wasn't filled with crowds for live music, it was for a brat fry, darts, or cornhole. The camaraderie, the people you meet. In any other job, you don't have the relationship that you do with the people in, in a bar business. The new owners plan to turn this joint into a restaurant, a fresh start, and a new chapter for the Emmer's. I wish them all the best, you know. They will do fine. In Sheboygan, Mackenzie Hamill, TMJ4 News. What a special place. Mackenzie Hamill covers Sheboygan County. If you live or work there and have a story idea for her, email it to the address that you see on your screen. We are just